son, you've got to listen to me. Now, I'm not, I'm not trying to tell you how to live your life, but you've never made a mistake like this before. You know, you've always been nothing but a source of pride for me and your mum, your whole life. But, Jesus, you don't know what you're doing. Now, this affair, it's all happened way too fast. You said so yourself, so you just gotta, you just gotta stop and think. I mean, have you thought about what people are gonna say? You know, for a man who's never put a foot wrong his whole life, you have stepped right in it, son. Yeah, that's for me to decide, Dad. So, can you just shut up and let me talk? Don't you say that to me. You don't have the right to say that to me. Not after what I've done for you. You know that and I know that. Oh yes, I know what you are and what you've made of yourself. But you know that I worked my ass off to get the money to buy you every chance you had. You know how far I carried that bag in 30 years? 75,000 fucking miles! And then mowed lawns in the dark so you wouldn't have to clean floors and could concentrate on your studies. And your mum! Things that should have gone to her. No, no, no. She insisted instead that the money went to you. And I'm not talking about flash things. I'm talking about a coat. I'm talking about a decent fucking coat! And you're gonna tell me all of that means nothing. And it's gonna break your mum's heart. This is between you and me, boy. Yeah, that's exactly where it's at. This is between you and me. You listen to no, me. No, you listen to me, alright? You say you don't want to tell me how to live my life? What the fuck do you think you've been doing? Telling me what rights I've got and haven't got? This is just bullshit. I owe you nothing. Because you were the one that brought me into this world. And from that day on, you owed me everything you could possibly do for me. Just like I'll owe my son if I ever have one. But you don't own me. You don't own me, Dad. You and your whole lousy generation believe that the way it was for you is the way it's got to be for us. And it's not until your generation is dead will that dead weight of you be off our backs. Do you understand that? You've got to get off my back, Dad. Dad. You're my father. And I'm your son. I really love you. I always have and I always will. But I've got a decision to make, Dad. And I've got to make it now. So can you just go out there and look after Mum?